Hi, it's Hazy and welcome to my channel. You've heard of whimsical flowers. I've made some whimsical butterflies and they are so easy. Okay, so if you like the idea of this, please give me a thumbs up. Share my video with your friends. Press the notification bell with your crafty fingers. And please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thank you so much. And I've got a Facebook group, Crazy... Crazy Hazy, no, Hazy Crazy Arts, <laughs> same as my channel. Okay, there is a link in the description as well. Okay then, so let's go. Okay, so I was doing a video last night, I f finished, it's only going to be a little video showing you how to paint flowers with this huge brush. But then I came across the idea of painting <laughs> butterflies. So, but they've got, and not only that, there will, if you haven't got a huge brush like this, there is a, perhaps a, where you may have. So let me just show you with the huge brush. Oh, hold on a minute. I was using two different size brushes. Wait a minute. I've got a huge brush like this, which is it's over an inch long, and it's in its I would say almost um, half an inch wide. It's massive. Yeah, look. But anyway, that's upside down. Let's get that the right way around. I know it doesn't really matter, of course, but I want my butterflies the right way around. So there's your wing. And there's another wing. You can have them as fat as you like or as thin as you like. Where's my other brush? Is that it? Okay, so I'm going to get another colour. I've actually got some new new paint because my old paints... <laughs> Look, I've got no yellow. And I've, I've filled my green, and um, but it's wet because it's out of a tube. But never mind. Right, so I'm putting blues, blue for the next bit, look, see, ooh, ooh, see that's, that's brilliant, so if you've got a huge brush like that, that's brilliant, what if you haven't got a huge brush like that, let's have a look, this plaques would even take shorter, right, I'm not going to use paint on these because I don't, you may have some sort of um, inks or something like that, you may have these, and it does work. Right, what we got? Green, isn't it? So green. So I'm doing a pink and green butterfly now. And look at this. Absolutely. And I'm going to show you how to decorate some of them as well. Look, wing. Wing. Wing, wing. <laughs> wing, wing. Who's there? <laughs> Not really. There we go. That's the other one. And that's the other one. There we go. So that, that would be easy to actually perhaps draw on now with something like a black sharpie. So I'm going to define the wings now. Look at this magic. Uh, the reason I'm doing this, I know that you say, oh, you can have digitals and talk. What if you, if you haven't got digital stuff like that? These are just sort of whimsical version because the other day I thought to myself, I want a I want a butterfly in this picture. Let me show you. I'll just finish this off in a minute. <laughs> I'm nearly finished. Right, there's a, there's a butterfly. I wanted a butterfly in my picture, but it didn't match these flowers. The one I had, the digital one, or even one out of a book page, wouldn't really match these flowers. I did demonstrate it on the on this video but I've done that did that yesterday using those brushes actually and it matches that is fine on this piece so if you do those whimsical flowers it, these butterflies will match those so you can put them in the picture as well you can see what I mean look All right so I've drawn around those and then you draw a body or you can, what you can do is actually cut out a body separately because sometimes I've found that I cut off when I've cut these out, I've cut off the head and things like that. No, it's okay, Nico. Nobody's there. <laughs> Just heard the door clock, the car door close, I'm trying to say. Right. Okay, so and then you can put patterns on. Right, let's have a look, see what I've already done. I've done that one. That was just, that was the same size brush. That was a, that was the big brush. So I've cut out patterns on that one. This is one similar to that, and I've just drawn little circles on that, and that one too, doing, doing some like target circles, 
on those and then some lines well, that was brush that was one of those I'm just waiting for that to dry then we can do that one and there's another but say one of those but I've pointed the wings a bit just to make it look slightly different quite like the round wings best I think you see they go with things like this and and look how I've decorated that's done by brush that flower was made by brush just doing the five points doing the head two arms and two legs basically there we go I can show you that one let me just give you a quick demo while we're waiting for that to dry right what we got we've got probably got green on the brush haven't we uh, let's try and get that green I always do green flowers though don't I that's my thing Nothing wrong with green flowers if it matches something, is it? Okay, so let's give you a demo how to. This is what I was originally going to do. Actually, I did. A, I did a whole video last night, and I did. I did the whole thing. Let's use the red. I haven't used much red. Right, the brush actually has, has a lot of it on this side rather than in the middle. These brushes are quite expensive, so I don't know. I actually got this in a set, it might have been, I can't remember, I wouldn't have paid that much for it. So head, this is so you can see it, and so that's a massive flower there, <laughs> and two legs, head, two arms and two legs, like a bit like a teddy, perhaps a teddy bear perhaps, so if you could do that, or well, obviously you can use these I've got different colors in there I could do a different color one I haven't um, done anything but green and pink but if you've got them little brushes I don't know if I don't know if you could do them with this with these um I don't know that's all right that's a black there that's a green yeah, look, I'm using the ooh, look, look, using the correct num correct colour on the correct brush. What am I like? <laughs> right, let's have a go. I don't know if it works so well. We could have a go. You can't see it. Oh, you can now. So you've got to turn it a bit. You wanted to make a huge flower, that'd be all right, wouldn't it? One of these, because <laughs> then you've got the. Um, if you've got that, so if you've got those, and perhaps you've got one of those, or a brush, I could still do it. Let's do the pink. Let's do the pink. Let's do the pink. Rest of it pink. Like that. Because you want something slightly smaller, because these are usually about an inch. And these are about an inch across. Now, these are usually about an inch across, aren't they? <laughs> anyway, that's a weird shape, butterfly. And if you remember that when butterflies, they are the different shaped wings. Butterflies aren't joined all the way down their body. They're just joined in part of it. Um, normally they've got a, well I suppose like any insect, a head, a thorax and an abdomen. So they'll be joined on the thorax. I'd imagine, I'd, I don't know. <laughs> we learnt at school that insects, that's how insects would do. Were, were joined and was only joined on the like all the legs and everything they were joined on the thorax I assume it's the same for the wings and often you, butterflies head do look like a triangle because they've got a head and they've got two little things there before they have the antenna I'm not drawing the antenna because I cut them off apart from I've drawn that one Right, okay. let's get this dry. I have got dryers. I've got a, one of them um, dryers, but I'm not. Uh, I haven't got it out. <laughs> there we go. There we go. See, they're so easy, aren't they? So now we're gonna we're gonna show you decorating them. <clears throat> okay, <clears throat> oh, I just dropped on the floor. Oh, I've got one of my. Obviously, you can have them this colour, as we don't have to have them that colour. <clears throat> I'll tell you how. You can make a template, I suppose, if you like. 
So if you've got a piece of card, I'm stuck with that to a piece of card and cut it out. Oh, I don't matter if I go over it again, does that? If, you like, if you've got the perfect shape, that's another way of doing it, isn't it? There we go, that'll do, won't it? I can, t I can see where that is. There we go. So perfect shape, perfect little butterfly there. Hopefully you can see them okay. I'm just, um, I don't know if I'll be able to move it in a bit. I've got the, cam the camera's narrowed next to my nose. <laughs> right, okay. Um, there we go. I think the wings ideally should be a slightly bit there, but that doesn't matter, does it? It's a, it's a design. It should be more like that. Right then. Right then, so I because I didn't show you properly last night on the video, I'm going to redraw for you what I did. There we go. And... You should be able to see, you can see this, can't you? <laughs> I, can, I can only see the bar where it's, the um, phone's joined onto the... There we go, you see, see now it's making it into a butterfly and that's dry so I can put my pen on straight away, a bit close, but hey. Right. What does happen to... Aha. Oh, uh -huh. Well, that's probably the last Sharpie in my box where have I put them all. Right, so now I'm going to draw around the wings. Obviously, we've done this before. Can you see? I'm trying to keep my hand out of the way this time because I'm always putting it in the way, aren't I? Right. Now I'm going to show you what I did. Where's the, uh -huh. Right. So it's. So basically, I was copying the peacock butterfly, it goes like this. We got eyes here. And also here. It doesn't matter how big or small you do them, don't worry about that. This is whimsical. Right, and then you've got I don't I didn't quite do it the same on the pink one, but hey I like this what I did on the blue one. Like that. And that, oh yeah, I did it down there as well. I think on the pink ones I did, I did either spots or stripes, like that. I could do spots, circles, stripes, anything like that. There we go, and then let's have a look at my little head. I haven't drawn his antenna yet, you know. We were saying, weren't we, that the, um, what do you call it? Oh yeah, the, it, the wings are actually joined on the thorax. Um, I don't think I showed you properly on my little demo either. Oh, is that a big one there? Oh, there it is. I don't know how, which one, that, who's the, who did this one? I don't think it's por my porch prints because they were different. But look, that's a massive butterfly there, and you can see there's the head, there's the thorax, and there's the abdomen. And if you look, they are, it, all the legs and the wings are actually joined together on this bit. So, otherwise you won't be able to flut, flutter, would it? <laughs> okay, so um, that's, what I'm, that's what I say. And it doesn't matter with whim, whimsicals, but I was trying to achieve that effect. <laughs> Oh yeah, you can do what you like with whimsicals, can't you? Yeah, so that's your beautiful little insert there. And I've, that's in the sun. I thought I'd do it directly in the sunlight. And it's morning and I'm going to upload this along with my video today. There we go. Uh, oh, by the way, have you noticed I'm doing really, really short intros now? I mean, this day is only 37 seconds, <laughs> I think. Depends if I have to edit it. Okay then, so let's carry on with the rest of it. 
okay so I can imagine they go well with these okay I'm going to try and cut them out now that not that I can find the best scissors but I'm going to try and cut them out oh no they're not them got some new scissors they're not my best one I've got some new scissors I thought these were quite nice I've got these my birthday Okay, so I'm going to cut these out. Right then, so um, no. what my idea is, I know you, know, you paint the page when you're doing those whimsical flowers, don't you? A lot of you do, because that's what you, you've not watched. Probably not seen my video. What am I doing with this? It was not a one, it was this. Hello, Laurie. Goodbye, Laurie. There we go. Right, so now we get some... How big that is? That's massive. <laughs> Mind you, it goes with this. Right, let's get some... Circles now. Yeah, if I have my little scissors wherever I've put them, I'll be able to cut them out perfectly. I don't know. I know I didn't let my granddaughter have. My granddaughter had some of my scissors to her. Cut. Oh, you can cut out some of my digital butterflies if you like. And use them and I give her a sheet and of course she's taken the whole lot that I had printed out of the packet. Yeah. Was it this one I was going to do? Oh no, it's that one. Right. Let's do a bit closer. But this time we're going to show you. Right then, so oh, I've got a bit of shadow somewhere. Where is it? Oh, me, that's my glue. <laughs> anyway, so what I was showing you, although I didn't show you, was I was putting little circles cut out ones, I cut them out, didn't I, on video, and then I was just putting them on the wings, like this, okay, what did I, oh, I actually drew them, I've actually cut out some more, so you can cut out two lots if you like and do this, oh yeah, that's quite good actually. Do that sort of thing. Um, where, where, which way right direction are they in? A sort of. It's okay, dog. I'm not talking to you. <laughs> he looks at me as if I'm. What are you talking to, Nanny? Who are you talking to? Yeah. So, so I don't know. I'm not sure who, who's watching. Okay. Uh, hopefully, we've got people watching. Ooh, hello there, Marcy. Marcy's regularly watching. Thank you. Hello, Marcy. And Patricia's regularly watching. Hello. And we have Marcella who regularly watches and Ellen. Hello, Ellen. Right. Uh, Marcy, I don't know where Marcy comes from. Probably America. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, actually. <laughs> and um, Patricia, I know she lives in Colorado. Marcy, Ohio. Ohio, no, that's what I meant it. Is it? Yes, it is, isn't it? Ohio. And, um, what's the other? oh, and Ellen's Germany. I know you regularly watch me, so hello to you. Uh, there's others too. Cynthia's given me a couple of messages re recently. I've heard from Bridget sometimes. And who else? 
just trying to think of all your names as we go and um it's the ones that oh there's somebody else beginning with c isn't there is it Cynthia? i'm think i've done cynthia haven't i cynthia i thought there's another c one um Oh, was that one on the group? Uh, Marcia D. Yeah, Marcia D. And um, we can put them. We can put these where you like, but I'm just putting them <laughs> at the places right. So I've just I've cut out some extra ones and put them on there. But you can also draw them, which I'm going to do with the small ones. I mean, we're going to get rid of all the glue, aren't we? As well, wherever my glue cloth is, I can't. I could, do you know what? That looks there. Ooh. I never found my faithful glue cloth. I've washed it. I put it in the washer. I'm not putting it in anything. And it's disappeared where all those odd socks go. <laughs> so it's never returned. Right, okay. Right, with the... This I'm doing an eye, sort of another... Not actually eyes, are they? Obviously, they just look like eyes. I said that they are eyes, but they're not... <laughs> That's why I put that little note. Obviously, this is a different. Um, I've done it differently to the other one, haven't I? The other one's got green wings and uh, above, and uh, blue wings below. So I'm basically doing the same as I did on the other one. Uh, which one's got the? It's this one, isn't it? It's got the big thick. So I'm doing this. I hope you can see them. Okay, I'm showing you this time getting stuck to the page with the glue there we go right then I don't know if my little all my little interactive things are going to catch on <laughs> I've got loads and loads and loads of videos and you know I'm getting like 60 views and I'm thinking are actually people watching do people understand what I'm trying to do right then so there's that anyway oh that looks really I really 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 love these Obviously, I've got the, you'll see the end product, and the, obviously the one I'm using with this has got green wings and the blue thing. What else did I talk about? Have I mentioned, oh yeah, I've got a little note here, I don't think you can see it, but it says, it goes perfectly with the whimsical flowers. I did do a little demo of the whimsical flowers. There's one of mine. It's like, um, oh look out, <laughs> this looks really close up. It's like one of... Um, Natasha's but oh yeah and it's got the Patricia Stanley type <laughs> oh yeah that's, another, that's a lady off the go I don't know if she watches my channel but she's on one of the groups um type little um thing there which I think was absolutely amazing that she did right where's some of those really nice I know I've done them at the end so if you don't see them now I've done them at the end I've also done leaves and that and I've also done things like this which I, I'll show you on my I'll show you on my actual um flower video as well which is different to Natasha's I'm not copying Natasha's I'm just doing something different um, as well which is just as easy because I'll show you how to draw things like that does that look complicated yes it does but it isn't you'll see you would see if you looked oh these are Patricia, Patricia Stanley's style I oh, love that gorgeous <laughs> Patricia Stanley style with those little loops she said she just drew them out I thought oh I love it Right, um, okay, let's think, oh there's one, there's one, this is the one, these are one of the ones I really, see these are like Natasha's but, but more so, you know what I mean, they've done, I've done something extra to them, so they can do all that, you know, you can make them all different, you don't have to do them as, as, um, as shown on your YouTube thing, just to go, go for your own thing, I think that looks because you just it's not wrong <laughs> it's not wrong <laughs> so anyway hopefully you've seen them okay now uh, i've been doing some more while i've been you can see those as well okay then so i'll just carry on with the video now and hopefully i won't have to have any more inserts okay i'm gonna let me see if i can where's the rest of these i'm sure there's oh yeah there was another one wasn't there that one that's been cut out so let's do that one um, I'm doing it the same as the other one. 
or virtually the same. I'm planning to put them down a page actually, that's what I'm going to do. I might even use some white on it. Will do, won't it? So there's some. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah. I'll put all my stuff. I'll put all my stuff away in a bit. And that oh, glue, look, glue without the pin and everything. Oh, I need that in a minute. So what am I doing? But never mind. Ooh, perfect, 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 perfect. I think this will be a perfect page if I can get there. Because I've got those, that on one side. And this can be on the other side. Don't have to have them flying straight. Um, put some flowers down. I've got loads, I've got a few of these. Somewhere, somewhere in there. Oh, there's one different colour. Okay, so that would be a perfect little scene, wouldn't it? Let's have them um, if I've got another but uh, another butterfly. Another flower, I don't know. I know I have two definitely have two. Oh that's one of those. Got those. And So that was done by, by brush, and two arms and two legs thing, and then just a little flower there. Let's see what else we've got? Oh, there's another. Look at that little. That's a nice one. Did I show you that one earlier? So I haven't even finished it. I haven't finished it. Look, did I? Was I talking and then I forgot to finish it? Oh no, it's okay, I know why. Because it wasn't dry last night when I did it. <laughs> when I did it when I was... Yeah. Oh, there's another one of those. But just without the leaf, that's all. Right then, so this is the page idea I've got. Okay, so using um, the opposite page of this, that's would be a journaling spot, and you could go down the page with these and then put your whimsical flowers, whimsical butterflies, whimsical flowers, yay, <laughs> down the page as well. That's These are all done by, oh no, that one's the brush, isn't it? These are all done by the uh, oxide brushes well whatever you know not oxide brushes they're not necessarily oxide brushes are they but the makeup brushes that's a mini one and there's all there's, there's different sizes in this set okay but you can obviously use the same size right, I'm going to glue these down I don't know whether I should have put something behind it I don't know To give it a, what do you call it? A, yeah, that's fine that way. I'm going to have that fine that way. And they're going to have that flying that way.
actually moved <laughs> I actually moved that because the wing uh, it's very thin there you know that's the look I'd like to achieve I think it's easier to have them less away from the body like that Let's have a pattern. There's no reason why you can't have a pattern, is there? There a pattern and that that's a pattern. <laughs> so there we go. Okay then. I do hate you like that. That looks that, what does that look like? Fine, yes. I would be tempted to put little I don't know, things look at that thing you brush things on the brush. Little circles or something between dotted about here and there so I might do that right not circles but flowers here yeah. so that's what I'd be doing because I think it would benefit from that in the design so I'm going to do that now okay right so this is um them with all the little dots and I think I might have benefited from little squares actually which would have been easier because you could just cut them out and then perhaps put the black pen around them which would have been much easier actually. I do hope you like my content today. Please give me a thumbs up. Please share my video with your friends. Press the notification bell with your crafty fingers. And please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thank you so much. And I've also got a Facebook group, Hazy Crazy Arts. The link is in the description anyway. Yay. I can't help playing with these. <laughs> Interactive stuff, I love it. Right, and there we go. And um, I will say bye now. Hope you've enjoyed that. And goodbye.